Let's go to an Android phone. Sweet. All right, you set it up, play around with it. Now you want to make it even better? Awesome. I'm Perry from Gadget Spot, and I've been using my LG G3 for quite a while now. We're going to take a look at every single app that I play around with every day over the next couple of weeks. So go ahead and hit subscribe down below if you'd like to see all of those. Let's get into it. So January is going to be the month of customization, so we're going to start off with my custom launcher. A free download in the Play Store. Action Launcher 3 by Chris Lacey is a great alternative to the stock launcher. With lots of custom theme options, as well as the ability to add cool new features to each icon, this launcher is a great replacement for things like Google Now or even Nova Launcher. But unlike those launchers, there is no app drawer. All of your apps are hidden to the left in alphabetical order in this scrollable list. This makes things a little bit easier to find, as well as a lot cleaner. Now, Action Launcher also has a few cool new features such as when you slide up on an app like this, you can get to its widget. Same thing with Talon. Folders are different too. When you slide up on an app, you can now get to the folder, or if you just touch the app icon, you can get straight into that app, like the camera right here. This allows for a little bit more room on your dock, as well as more functionality. Now one of the coolest new features in this update is themes. You'll notice that the search bar at the top matches the color from our wallpaper, and this happens no matter what wallpaper you use, whether it be a castle or just another Android L wallpaper. But maybe Action Launcher isn't for you. That's okay. The Google Now Launcher is stock on many devices, or you can actually pick up Nova Launcher in the Play Store as well. That was one of my personal favorites before I tried Action Launcher. Speaking of, all three of those will be found in the description, as well as links to Gadget Spot's Google Plus account, Twitter account, and my personal accounts too. So if you want to follow me and see when we update things, go ahead and hit the links in the description. Make sure to tune in next week where we're going to cover all of the wallpapers you saw in this episode as well as talk a little bit about how you can make your Android just a little bit more alive. All right, guys, see you next week.